Hello, friends. This is Professor Gublov. Today's video will be a little unusual, but I'm sure you will like it. So, get comfortable and let's go. If you come across this flower, stay away from it. In this video, you will witness the most deadly plants that prey on animals, from a flower that devours vertebrates and primates to a plant that sheds tears of deadly poison. Nepenthes. Let's start by taking a look at the Nepenthes. Nepenthes is one of the largest carnivorous plants in the world, found in Indonesia, Malaysia, and China. This plant is nicknamed the monkey cup because monkeys often drink rainwater from it. While larger primates have no trouble with it, small monkeys sometimes get trapped in these plants. And they become the plant's meal. These plants also capture insects and small vertebrates, such as mice. Nepenthes produces two things, extremely sweet nectar and wax. They attract many animals that crawl into the flower. The sweet nectar lures them in, while the wax pulls them inside, trapping them. The poor creatures get stuck in the flower and eventually die within it. The Nepenthes then absorbs the nutrients. This plant is both terrifying and harmless at the same time. Darlingtonia Let's now look at an even more frightening animal-eating plant, the Darlingtonia. It thrives in areas with extremely poor soil, which means it has to obtain nutrients from other sources, such as animals and insects. The Darlingtonia was named after American physician and botanist William Darlington. The Darlingtonia attracts animals with its sweet nectar. Its leaves are partially translucent, which means any unfortunate insect or animal that gets trapped inside will soon become entangled. Darlingtonias are incredibly rare, and those who have seen these plants say they look like something from another planet. Like other plants, Darlingtonias absorb water from the soil. What makes this flower unique is its ability to regulate water levels. This means that if a Darlingtonia desires, it can drown the animals trapped inside it. This plant is highly intricate and ingenious. Bladderwort. Moving on, let's take a look at the bladderwort. Bladderwort also preys on animals, but it does so in a unique way. It is the only carnivorous plant that uses a bladder to capture its victims. The underwater bladder and leaves have tiny surface traps called triggers, and when an insect touches one of these trigger hairs, a bladder is formed. It sucks in the prey along with water. The bladder can only catch and swallow very small prey, but it does so at lightning speed. Bladderwort is known as the fastest plant in the world. Portuguese Sundew Now, let's examine the Portuguese Sundew. This carnivorous plant can be found in Portugal, Spain, and Morocco. It grows in dry soil with low nutrient content because it obtains all its nutrients from animals. Insects often get trapped in its sticky grasp. The leaves of the Portuguese sundew curl outward. Dew sticks to any insect that comes close to the plant, and then the sundew starts to curl even more. Eventually, the insect dies from exhaustion or suffocation. Enzymes are then released, breaking down the fly, allowing the sundew to absorb all the nutrients from the insect. The plant attracts animals with its yellow flowers and a powerful sweet scent. Stylidium. And now, we want to show you this trigger plant. If something touches it, the trigger is activated, covering the insect with pollen. As a result, the insect loses its orientation. Remarkably, stylidium can release pollen in just 15 milliseconds. The trigger plant also produces nectar that causes small insects to stick to it. Then, its leaves release enzymes that kill these poor creatures. This plant is found in Australia in over 300 different species. Butterwort. Next up is the butterwort. This carnivorous plant is quite terrifying as it emits a sweet scent that attracts insects. The scent lures these creatures into its pitcher. Once the insects are inside, there's no way back. The butterwort is semi-transparent, which confuses the insect. It exhausts itself and eventually dies from exhaustion. The insect is slowly digested by the butterwort. This plant may appear beautiful, but it shows no mercy to its prey. Genela sea. Now let's take a look at the Genela sea. Genela sea is also known as the corkscrew plant. This organism feeds on protozoa using its unique leaves. The underwater leaves deceptively resemble roots but are highly poisonous. Genela sea is found in Africa, Central, and South America. Aldrovanda. 
Let's meet the Aldrovanda, also known as the waterwheel plant. This carnivorous aquatic plant is considered the most ruthless underwater plant in the world. It employs traps to devour small underwater creatures. The traps are attached to the stem of the plant. Both parts of the trap can snap shut very suddenly, ensnaring insects or small fish. This happens within milliseconds whenever someone swims nearby. The traps behave as if they have their own brain. When the small marine creatures perish, all the nutrients go into the plant. Venus flytrap. And now, let's take a look at the Venus flytrap. The Venus flytrap is one of the most famous carnivorous plants found throughout America. The plant seems to have a mind of its own, although it is not very complex. If the trap detects something inside it, be it an insect, a small animal, or even a human finger, it closes shut. In recent years, it has become trendy to buy Venus flytraps for home use. It's an excellent way to get rid of houseflies during the summer. Venus flytrap is highly common, and it's also a very peculiar plant. If you think about it, it looks like the mouth of an alien with sharp teeth. Moreover, this plant is more ruthless than its other carnivorous relatives. Instead of drowning or suffocating its prey, it simply captures the prey in its claws. This triggers one of the tiny spines of the Venus flytrap, which starts a 20-second timer. If another spine is triggered within that time, the trap closes. This is done to prevent the trap from closing due to useless things like leaves. When a fly touches six or more spines, digestive enzymes are released. This way, the Venus flytrap knows it has caught something worthwhile and proceeds to extract all the nutrients from the insect. Remarkably, these flytraps can catch giant insects like cockroaches and large spiders. Drosera liniflora. Next, let's examine Drosera liniflora. This plant weeps tears of death. It is named after the ancient Greek princess Biblis, who fell in love with her twin brother named Conus. But when Conus rejected her, the woman cried so intensely that she died of sorrow. The same fate befalls any animals that come into contact with this plant. Drosera liniflora cries sticky droplets of shimmering liquid. It is a transparent sweet fluid. The droplets sit on the plant and spread out, creating a rainbow-like shimmer in the sunlight. The plant is highly attractive but deadly to insects. They get trapped in the liquid. The brightly colored leaves release enzymes that digest the insects and absorb their nutrients. This plant is mainly found in Australia, a country known for its terrifying animals, so it's logical that scary plants exist there too. Well, as I promised, the video was interesting. So, subscribe to the channel, give it a thumbs up. See you tomorrow. Bye for now.